The sights and sounds of a marching band are common during the summer months. Our Josh Peterson spent some time with Bemidji High's marching band as they prepare for a regional performance. It has the sound of an epic superhero feature film. But that sound is coming from the Bemidji High School marching band, who has been practicing each day to fine tune this year's marching band show, Invincible, which is considered a step above past marching band routines. The music in this show is a little bit more complicated than last year. We've got a lot of mixed meter inside. And as a, as a marching band director dealing with mixed meter, it gets a little bit like, well, should I do this? Yep. Um, but the kids have just, just knocked it out of the park. For the band's drum majors, this year's routine has a higher level of difficulty, requiring more focus and a lot more practice. This year we've practiced a lot. We've had a lot more time because of school got down earlier, but uh, we practice every day and we drill music a ton, trying to get the music to be the best it can be. But practice always makes perfect, and while doing so, making memories that will last a lifetime. I'm really looking forward to the memories we're going to have, especially because this is the first trip. I think it will really, it'll be remembered throughout the Bemidji Marching Band. Normally the final performance for the BHS Marching Band is in Bemidji with its appearance in the annual Water Carnival Grand Parade. But this year that appearance will only be a warm-up for a much larger regional stage in Chicago. Every time we go out, we just try to do the best show that we can put on the street. Um, but when you know that you're going out of your own state that far away to, to march in somebody else's 4th of July parade, kind of want to make it memorable for the people that are there. With only a few opportunities to perform locally, every performance is another warm-up for the marching band's showcase appearance on a regional and national stage for Chicago's 4th of July celebration. In Bemidji, Josh Peterson, Lakeland News. And if you'd like to catch a performance by the Bemidji High School Marching Band, you can do so during the Water Carnival Grand Parade on Sunday, July 2nd through downtown Bemidji. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.